this award is something that I feel like I share with those people who have suffered, who've lost their lives, and the people who've taught me about how to be a better journalist. In the last seven years, tens of thousands of people have died because of Mexico's drug war. As a cartoonist, I thought it would be appropriate to thank the politicians from whose faces I have drawn inspiration over the years. I had blown off an interview with the Pope. <laughs> that happened 36 years ago, but I still think about it now and then. Usually an hour or two before dawn. I don't know why I'm telling you, giving away all my secrets here, but my best all-time sources are former employees. I don't care if they have an ax to grind. As long as the information's accurate, how do you connect with a subject who's more difficult to crack? I never want to publish a photo of someone who's not comfortable with it. However, I will go to the person and say, this is why I think it's important. In any culture, meet the person with the highest rank, male or female, you're in. But that you, you need to do that very quickly. Ask the women about what's going on in their countries, and they're often the first ones to warn us about things, but because they're the first ones to feel it and see it. We didn't stay in the United States. We looked at fracking in the US, fracking in Canada, fracking in Europe. If we can preserve and protect press freedom in Hong Kong, it's going to be a lot easier to improve it in China. If in Washington they had fully absorbed the meaning of the fall of the frontier, we might never have uh, made the mistake of getting involved ourselves in the war in Vietnam. We could see all of these planes going to take off. And he says, history is being made tonight. The first planes have taken off to bomb Iraq. Sitting there thinking, my God, where's the phone? More people get sick than they do get blown up. You guys are going to get hurt no matter what you do out there. Uh, you're going to get sick, you're going to get hurt. Uh, all those things you need to be prepared for. It's an incredibly competitive market now, but it's also incredibly dangerous. And there are certain requirements now for, for people we commission. Mm -hmm. If they're going somewhere dangerous, they have to have a hostile, hostile environment course. I don't want you to go and be a cowboy just because you want to be a cowboy so I can publish you. No, that's not the name of the game. I just want us to remember that there are many cases where journalists are killed, not in conflict areas, where uh, local journalists are killed. So we are honored to light this candle tonight to remind all of us of the high cost of knowing the truth and our responsibility to protect and support those who seek it.